It was a special night at the Thomas Jefferson Democratic Club in Canarsie Thursday. Even though it was a regularly scheduled meeting, on this night, members were endorsing a candidate for state senate. The meeting was led by Brooklyn Democratic boss Frank Sedio, who seemed right at home as he cracked jokes with the friendly audience. I had a good joke. I don't know if I could tell it tonight. We have TV cameras on. Uh, I'll tell you later. Roxanne Persaud was elected to the assembly last year, but when the seat held by John Sampson became vacant, she saw an opportunity. John Sampson made his mark. John Sampson did a very good job. So it's not, I'm not looking to, to, to become John Sampson. I'm looking to put Roxanne Prasad's stamp on the district. Observers say getting the endorsement of the Thomas Jefferson Club is tantamount to winning the seat in this heavily Democratic district in Brooklyn. The candidate that we have will endorse will most likely be the winning candidate. Now, I'm always a little superstitious. There is an election to have to run by. Sedio has been associated with this club for 50 years. Some famous Brooklyn Democrats have come out of here, including U.S. Senator Charles Schumer. We've been fabric of this community for so long that the endorsement means a lot just because of the cross-pollination of the, of the 19th senatorial district, so it is significant. There's no primary being held for the seat this year, and some have been critical that the candidates for the few open state legislature seats in this off-year election have been hand-selected by party bosses. I'm not sure what that means. That sounds like a dirty kind of, oh, the bad guys, the terrible backspill room. Look around this room. See anybody that seems significantly potent in any way? These are the regular people. Prasad says she looks forward to serving in the upper house. Congratulations, Rox. We love you. Thank you, guys. Prasad is expected to be formally nominated at a meeting scheduled for next month. Once she is selected, she'll stand for election in November. In Canarsie, Zach Fagg, New York One.